whole entire mountain range here. It's uh, pretty incredible. Foundation's taken a few of the rifles. We have 10 rifles with all sorts of different scopes and stuff like that. Have any questions about price, cost, that stuff, talk to Victor. Uh, obviously, the best dealers in Canada, so everything you see and shoot is going to be for sale. There are many enough big, big dealers in one of our. the Hell's Canyon series here, which is our uh, Grand Serico, new last year, um, very popular. Uh, this was probably our most requested item in the business. And we've got one on a McMillan stock and another one on our basic uh, dirt touch stock. That's speed, that's the McMillan right there. Right. So it'll be a choice of, I'm not sure whether we're all going to get to mix and use both platforms, but essentially you'll uh, hopefully have a chance to shoot them both. See which one you like. Then. Six pounds, six and a quarter pounds on the speed and about seven and a half. Uh, so in 1892, Daniel Swarovski invents a machine that precisely cuts crystals. So he, he was one of the, he's the founder of Swarovski as, as we know it. It's modular, um, it's spectacular, and we've got a couple of those we bring out there. And then the, this does have on there. This was an amazing event that I would recommend all hunters take. A wealth of information tailored to hunters of every caliber. With professional instruction on some of the most complicated theory right down to basic field positions. The fact that we got to learn how to sight in these scopes and how to shoot long range really put things into perspective for me because as a hunter when you're shooting long range you want to make sure you take down that animal and make sure you get an ethical kill no doubt to start we're going to familiarize the rifle shooting play play first, but then we're going to go over play 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 shooting long range what you need to do the adjustments yeah. holdovers and stuff so to start you guys are just going to start punching paper at 100 yards now it seems like everybody's comfortable we're already starting to hear people hit steel down range which is good um, so we're going to go start using, uh, start some shooting in the pro position, some real field positions now. Uh, we're going to kind of... It's more of a field application. You're hunting, you're probably going to have a backpack. You're probably going to have a pair of binoculars, something like that. I carry, I showed some guys this. I carry this, this is my dog spot, it's a glove. It's my rear support when I'm hunting. I can still grab my binos, I can grab my pack, I can get up, I can move, I can dial, I can do everything, I can blast with it. A lot of guys like a shooting With your eyes, there's that arm drop into your rifle. It should be right there. Headshot. Practice it. Get down here, try to build your house quickly, and just pick out different things. There it is, I want it there. You're in the scope. I use this. Bipod. These carpets are sliding a little bit, but you should be able to get it in here and load it enough. I can look. I'm already on the target. If you want to push in, don't lean back because the gun will start bouncing. And if you shoot, and I see the gun go like this, when it jumps left or right, that means you, you can't. If, it, if my legs are like this, it'll always jump like this. You're trying to get right behind the rifle. You know, the legs out as much on the ground as possible, load the bipod, look over the top of the turret, settle in. You know, you can, you can read dope, you can parallax, but in the end of the day, when you shoot, the gun should bounce and come right back down onto the target. There are many factors to take into consideration when using a rifle to hunt. Most important is safety. 
As we know, ammunition costs can add up. You could spend countless shells on targeting alone. With this course, you'll save money down the road, having the ability to reach your targets quickly and efficiently. There's no question you need confidence in your equipment and knowledge in order to take down wild game at long range. Ethically, it is your responsibility to minimize pain and suffering in any animal you harvest. This is a 300 yard challenge in a sitting position with shooting sticks. Yeah, one shot out of the mess you're out. There's no comparison to watching a YouTube video to that of having one on one instruction from a true professional in the field. Hey. Good job, bud. Had to start strong. Who's going to be first? At the end of the day, some of our lucky participants were awarded some amazing prizes. One prize in particular was a $1,600 Swarovski rifle scope. Right, right. Please contact Italian Sporting Goods for more information on upcoming events.